Welcome to another video of SpaceX updates. It looks like we are having a quiet week at Starbase. There was no testing at the launch site today. All road closures for this week have been cancelled. Instead, crews are seen working on the OLM, Ship 24's tiles, and chopstick arms. Back at the production site, inside the Mega Bay is three boosters standing next to each other. Booster 8 is likely to be rolled out to the launch site soon for testing before Booster 7 makes its way to the launch pad again. Going across the country, we can see excellent progress at the SpaceX Roberts Road facility at Cape. Another flyover by Ferriel and Greg Scott provided amazing shots from the Florida Starship launch facility. The new Star Factory is getting its walls and roofs. The chopstick arms are getting along nicely. As the fifth segment of the new Starship launch tower was installed already, the next segment will probably be rolled out next week. All the remaining four segments of the tower can be seen being assembled in this shot by Greg Scott. A mystery tank, whose purpose is not yet known, has been stacked on top of a standing structure this evening. That doesn't look like a propellant tank to me, and we don't see a similar tank at Starbase, Texas. What do you think it is? A water tank maybe? South Korea is set to launch its first lunar mission tomorrow. Korea Pathfinder Lunar Orbiter, officially known as Danuri will be launched by a Falcon 9 rocket from Space Launch Complex 40 at Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida. This will be Korea's first ever mission to the moon with different instruments on board developed by Korean Aerospace Research Institute and NASA. The liftoff is scheduled for August 4 at 7.08 p.m. Eastern Time to put the spacecraft into a ballistic lunar transfer orbit. That is it for now. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel for future updates related to SpaceX.